Um, won't chastity make a relationship boring? This is actually a question I got when I was in class answering a Q&A session. The first thing I said was, um, oh actually, so I'm dating a girl and we have to keep a six foot radius between each other whenever we see one another, so um, it's a little weird. And all the kids were like, oh my goodness, are you serious? And I said, <laughs> no. Absolutely not. We hold hands and everything. It's totally normal. Listen, I can say from personal experience, chastity does not make a relationship boring. It actually makes it so much more exciting. Side note, for those of you who are wondering what chastity is, it means saving sex and all sexually intimate acts until marriage. Not, and that doesn't mean no sex at all. It just means sex in its proper place. Marriage. Now, I know what you might be thinking. <gasps> you are a, a murderer! Blah, 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 blah. You've heard it all before, we get it, I know. But here's the thing, without chastity, without virtue, we're the ones that become boring, which in turn will make the relationship boring. So, no sex? TV? I mean, think about it. If the possibility of sex is all that makes a relationship exciting, then that's a pretty boring relationship. Chastity actually challenges us in the season of dating to aspire to great love. It's a lot easier to end up in bed with someone than to love them in a way that is truly self-sacrificing, in a way that's courageous, in a way that's radical. To be able to have the courage and honesty to enter into each other's hearts, to be vulnerable, to be real with one another, and that's a connection that lust could never replace. We have to be able to get creative with one another, and in that, a relationship becomes so much more dynamic. Let me give you a quick example of this creativity, all right? My girlfriend and I actually wanted to go grab some milkshakes at this restaurant. So I take her out, drove, got some milkshakes, and it was awesome, had a great time, but I had a little secret packed in the back seat of the car. I had some blankets, and we we're gonna lay out the blankets and sit underneath the stars. Now, I know what you're thinking, and it's not like that. We drove back, we're just talking, sitting on the blanket, and then I played some Frank Sinatra, and I got up and I said, will you dance with me? And then she said, oh, of course. We danced with each other underneath the stars, and let me tell you, man, they thought it was pretty sweet. Now, I'm not saying we have to get all flashy and natural all the time, I'm just saying, our relationships will become all the more dynamic when we choose to be creative. There comes a point in a relationship where the emotion is gone and the sentiment is gone and all you have left is just the choice. Do I choose this person? And if we're loving the way we're called to right now, we're gonna be fully alive. If you want your relationship to be adventurous, live out chastity. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Click right here for... Mm, Thanks so much for watching. Check back every week for more videos. Click right here to subscribe and right here if you want to check out more of these sweet videos. You know what I'm saying? Woo! Ah! Sorry, I don't know what that was.